Hello guys, this is Dr. Lior Barrell. Now this is another episode. Guys, see in the end of the video, there's going to be a playlist uh, for everything that is, uh, that we're doing a mini series right, right now for motorcycles, uh, cars, but motorcycles and um, uh, electric bikes. Uh, so uh, we're going to be doing a review on all of these uh, beautiful uh, things and we're going to, you know, go over it. We're going to we're going to test out some things that you guys are requested. I went ahead and bought these things. We're going to do reviews. And then the end of the video, uh, sorry, in the end of the mini series, I'm doing a prize giveaway. Definitely tune in for that. So today we're going to be doing a review for this thing, which they advertise pretty much everywhere. You guys know what I'm talking about. It is a portable, uh, basically filling up your <laughs> tire, does bikes, cars, basketball and boy i put them to the test and i got to tell you everything about it i cannot wait to tell you so let's not waste any time and let's get right into it <laughs> Okay, guys, so like I told you, I tested this baby, but uh, we're going to do an unboxing first, and then I'm going to tell you all about it. Uh, this thing is also advertised all over social media. You guys said you were looking for a portable unit, okay? So there were all kinds of different ones that I tested. Wasn't really happy with them. This one right here you could find in Walmart. I kid you not. Don't buy it from these advertisers on Facebook and Instagram. You don't know who's a ripoff and who's not. Some of them are charging $5 for it, which is a lie, and then some are charging the regular price. Just buy it off Walmart. It's like, I think it was like, 20 30 dollars i don't remember exactly uh but here we go let's do the unboxing uh you guys wanted to know how this thing uh operates okay so we're gonna do a review and I i'm gonna tell you all about it so first off there you go it looks like a freaking padlock i kid you not so we're gonna take out every little thing out of this oh man there's something in the back there and i cannot get to it um so i think we gotta rip through it huh it would have been nice if they gave some kind of a pouch for this thing, but whatevs. Uh, now, I don't know if there's anything else in here, but we're going to check that out right now because it looks like something is there because you see it has like, yes, there is. Oh, my God. Okay, so there is here. And you know something? I tested this, and I didn't even see it. I was just saying that it should have included a pouch, and I feel something soft, so I'm thinking it is a pouch. And some cool mounting things here. Uh, this one, it's weird because my friend had it, but it, I think his was in the box. Again, guys, it depends on where you're buying this, but buy it from Walmart just in case because everybody, uh, it's weird. They have a different name slapped on it, all kinds of things. This thing is like a no-name brand. I mean, it doesn't say anything on this damn thing. It's just look it up, portable, uh, you know, and that's it. <laughs> I'll put it up in the description, whatever the heck I got from uh, from Walmart. So anyway, so this is, I, I love that right there. I just love removing that. And we're going to remove this. To, actually, you know what? I'm not going to remove this right now. So this is like a padlock, right? But look at this. Okay, so you move that, this comes on. Now, you basically can, hold on, where's that thing? So it does come with a pouch, which I'm really happy about. That is cool. So we're gonna we're gonna look at that shortly. Uh, comes with oh hold on oops. Let me just so the second you put it back in, it's pretty cool. See, look at that, shuts right off. So that's pretty awesome. What I do wish it was, I wish it was actually a padlock. <laughs> that would have been really cool, but whatever. I'm not gonna complain here. So here you go, okay, for your basketball. Now I'm gonna talk about that too, okay. And this is a charging cable because you're going to be charging it. Now, you need one of these, and I'll tell you why. Because if something goes wrong, uh, you don't have enough pa uh, um, tire pressure, something's up, even a, a little leak. Uh, and, you, you know, you want to keep filling it till you get home and then patch that baby up, do whatever the heck it takes. You want to have something like this. You don't want to go in the road, especially... Um, for a long time on the road you don't want to go with something you know with nothing and then have to go to the gas station or something like that when you could just grab one of these right on the road and just fill up your your tires now i am going to say this i am a bit disappointed okay so i'm going to first we're going to talk about the positives basketball oh, oh god there we go oh basketballs you see i don't even edit it's all real time guys my foolishness all in real time so basket <laughs> basketballs all of that this will fill it up perfectly there's no doubt about it it will work it does charge and here's the beauty you guys could even have settings here hold on let me look here see 
different type of settings. Uh, as you can see, hold on. So C45, and also if you didn't want settings, what you could do is you could just simply hit the up and down button and control it the way you want. Exactly the uh, PSI that you want on it, okay, for your bike or, or car or whatever. We're, we're not going to talk car right now. And then you hit this, look at this. And it fills it up. Now the beauty about it is once it fills up, it just shuts off on them like it, it stops so once it reaches a certain psi it stops on its own so you don't have to monitor it i know they have some of them that you have to monitor and then pull out you don't need to do it with this that's why i love about it i just wish that this thing had a lock lock so not that i'm expecting it to be a padlock but i'm expecting it to hang on my bike without it you know i mean it is but you see it comes right out so if i'm on the road and it's it's gonna bump this thing is not it's not good to lie. Like, I wish it had some kind of mechanism here that you could pull it out, and then I could have this on that. But then again, it has an internal battery uh, that's rechargeable. You kind of don't want this thing bouncing around. It could pop on you, any kind of thing like that. It's better to keep it in your, in your bag or something like that. Now, here's the disappointing part, okay? Electric bikes on fat tires. This baby works really well. You will, you will fill up two with no problem. I even think four will work on one charge. So definitely worth that. Um, basketball, no problem. You could fill up a few basketballs. Uh, I'm willing to bet like eight or ten of them. I tried it on one. It just looked cool. And that's about it. Uh, you know, motorcycles, for some reason, uh, my friend said he tested them. I didn't test them personally. He said they work really well on his, on two tires only, he said. I don't know. So he said, I tried it, two tires, and it filled it up really well, and I had still a little bit of juice left, but that's about it. I tried it on a car. Again, they lie in their advertisements. Do not buy this for a car under any circumstances because it will not fill up. Uh, it will not do all four tires, not in a million years. I think the most it did was about a tire and a half uh, before it just completely died. And I'm talking about from zero to fill up. So, you know, if you want a maintenance or whatever, maybe you could get this and that'll be fine. But I, I can't say this with, a, with an honest, you know, uh, conscience here. I can't tell you to get this for a car. To get it for an uh, uh, electric bike, definitely. A motorcycle, definitely. A bicycle, definitely. Basketballs, yeah. Beach balls, <laughs> yeah. Any type of thing, really cool. I, I really love that it comes with a pouch. My friend didn't even have it, so I don't know if he knew that it was in that little square thing. So I'm going to tell him that if he didn't throw the box away. This is why I like to always cut the box into pieces. Uh <laughs> But um, it's something uh, definitely, you know, it, it has a purpose. And here we go. It comes with this thing here that just ripped really easily uh, <laughs> and tells you here. Okay. Um, oh, wait. That's here we go. Sorry. So it's all written in Chinese. Um, yeah, everything written in Chinese. No English whatsoever. But you, they have good picture illustrations, as you can see. It's really easy and very, very straightforward so you don't really need anything but it is cool that the fact that they have all of this just so it kind of like you know helps you out a bit that's all so i love that it has as you can see they just come with all of these things and these you could find anywhere really but it's cool that it comes with that uh and you know you just store it i wish this pouch had something to store this in like a little zipper compartment or velcro compartment and of course this is not the best thing in the world now something you guys need to know this is not a usb-c so just understand that um which is pretty sad i would have loved it to be usb-c but whatever i mean for the price you're getting it at, it's not bad. You're going to find this unit anywhere from about $27 to about $40, $50, bucks, about. Uh, so definitely do your shopping. See which one gives you sales. These pop-up vid uh, videos for it always have 10% sales, 20% sales. Just wait for them. Uh, if, you know, I lucked out on one of them. Uh, what was it? The phone holder, which uh, when it gets here, finally, uh, uh, we're going to do a review. I lucked out because I went and I contacted them and I said, do you guys have any kind of discount if I were going to get two? And so definitely they, you could haggle, okay? So you could haggle, haggle. I believe it was a Chinese market too. I'm not sure, but this one I bought from walmart so i mean it is what it is but go ahead and haggle with uh, some of these chinese markets and the pop-ups i got actually a discount of buy one get one for 50 percent off so i was happy with that so i got those two phone holders i wanted only one but whatever i mean if it sucks i got two i'll probably do a giveaway <laughs> if it's good um I'll, you know i'll probably do a giveaway on that as well um but really really cool uh so really awesome i think it's definitely worth it for what it does 
if you have a car, I'm going to say definitely if, you know, you're just looking for a little maintenance air in there, you'll probably be fine with that. Um, definitely not from zero and filled up. You're going to regret having it. So definitely I'm going to give that a four out of 10 on that. Actually, let's make it even three out of 10 for bikes, basketballs, um, motorcycles, electric bikes, beach balls, anything perfect guys okay absolutely perfect giving giving it a 10 out of 10 also doesn't get hot on me doesn't get anything on me i don't know at least to me it doesn't uh does what it says it does it does fill it up i love the fact that i don't have to monitor it the other one that was a longer one my friend had i don't know by what company it's another advertising one you guys didn't request that i didn't buy it thank god but if you ever see like a cylinder this thing you have to monitor and uh, literally you see it in the video a person's holding it in his hands and looking at it you really don't want to do that it does come with an led which which is pretty cool that you guys could see what's in front. Let's see if this one has an LED. I doubt it does, but, um, you know, which that was cool because you get to see uh, what's there. Uh, no, I don't think it does have an LED. It's just a charger port, and that's about it. I don't even know where the hell you charge this, to be honest with you. <laughs> uh, but, but uh, yeah, let's take a look here. So, yeah, it's somewhere here. Oh, I see. So this one right here is the, I think, right? Uh, let me take a look. So it's right here. That's why it's easily missed. <laughs> so you got to put it right in, uh, right in the kisser right here. But um, yeah. So like, this thing definitely, I'm giving it for what it is, a ten out of ten. Oh my god, no, it's not. It's not here. I don't know where it is. And because it's written in Chinese, I got to give it a 9 out of 10. Because, I mean, we need explanation, people. Uh, there's no reason why it shouldn't have... Oh, wait a second. It's telling me it's underneath. So it is there. I suspected it before. So you see right there, I guess you got to remove it. Let's see what the heck happens here. I don't even know how to... Oh, okay. So I was about to knock off a point. I kid you not. Because I thought this thing was going to just come off like it does on the... Uh, uh, what do you call that other uh, the sound recorder we did a review on so let's see how this thing works here i'm just curious i want to kind of like hook it up to something so because of a short wire you guys could see though it is it's charging and it has a nice white blink to it so that's pretty freaking cool so it's doing the charge anyways let's get right to it okay guys so what do i think of it i'm definitely giving it an 8 out of 10 only because i really think it's really nonsensical to just write it in chinese and not give us any type of things i mean i figured it out myself they have good picture illustrations but still kind of lame another thing that i had to knock a point off is the fact that the cable is so tiny it's tiny they couldn't even give a one foot cable which is ridiculous so i had to knock it off but in terms of practical uh, practicality uh, carrying this with you in the bag it's absolutely a must have a 10 out of 10 anyways guys let me know what you guys think like subscribe hit that bell button uh definitely gonna help out the algorithm as you guys see i buy these with my own money uh and uh that's the whole point that's the reason i opened this channel so we can sift through the fake paid for reviewers that tell you something is good when it's not and we give real information from real people like you and i i love you guys for offering the patreon services but i'd rather you guys keep that money i work three jobs to make this happen and it's working guys i'm paying for it i'm doing it we're helping out the community you guys are doing more than enough you know what you guys are? The jury. You agree with me? Disagree with me? Did you find something else that's better? I want to hear down below. I definitely want to hear down below. And together we help people make better informed decisions, especially in a time right now where people have to be really careful on what they're spending their money on. There's a lot of scam artists out there trying to rip you off and paid for reviewers just happen to help them do that. So this is what we're all about. We're all about giving the truth. And that's really all it is. Just solid truth from real people like you and I. Anyways, like, subscribe, hit that bell button. Have a good one, y'all. Take care. Bye. As always, guys, if you like what you see, self-funded here be sure to check out all my other uh stuff from mini series to unboxings to technology you know and uh nintendo reviews and 3d printer uh reviews and all that good stuff if you like what you see the only way you can help the channel is by liking uh this video subscribing and hitting that bell button as many more cool videos to come definitely want you guys in it and i want to I want you guys to be vocal definitely comment down below i want to hear what you guys have to say have a good one y'all take care bye